In past episodes, we've shown you how you can create images from your imagination using tools like MidJourney. Today, we're going to help you take your imagination to the next level by introducing you to a tool that transforms your ideas into visual stories of your dreams using AI. If you're ready to level up some amazing animated stuff, get ready for episode number six of The Bad AI Show. Five, four, three, two. One, zero. Who's bad? Hey, it's the Bad AI Show. Joel Com, Travis Wright here. We are original, authentic intelligence here to show you the way into the future and the present of artificial intelligence. We are the original burp and derps. Burp. <laughs> derp. Burp and derp. That's Does what that I call my I... kid. I call them derps. Come on, burp. little derp. Burp and derp. Billy derp and Jarek derp. They're the burp and derps. <laughs> <laughs> and um, so <laughs> today what we're doing is we're going to be going right into a really fun app that we like using images into video. Mm -hmm. And you can actually do this as text to video. But I've always found that if you do that, you don't get as good as an image of this thing. So let me just, should we go start in? Uh, yeah, I just want to point out for those of you watching the video version, these images behind us were created using this tool that we're about to show you. It is a web app and it's called Kyber. Kyber, K-A-I-B-E-R dot A-I is the website. And we're going to have a special link for you guys here at the end of this show. So Sir Lord Trav, go ahead and pull up the website yeah. for us. Well, I'll just tell you now it's badco.in forward slash Kyber. No, Keep it's it not. It's AIshow.io. Oh, we changed it. There we go. AI show. AI show. What is it? AI dot show? AI show dot IO forward slash Kyber. There we AI. go. All right. <laughs> all right. Pull it up. We're on brand by changing all of our brands around. Probably we got a lot going on. on. We even got fat Jimmy Amps going on up here. That's Jimmy. Right. All right. All right, so I'm going to share my screen right here and show you the program. Check it out. It is Kyber. This allows you to make your imagination real, you guys. So you can actually click on some of this and see some of the images that they've done. You can go in and type words in, and it will create them just off of your words. You don't need to use an image. Personally, I find that they're way cooler if you use a pre-existing image, you get something more like what you want. You know what I mean, Joel? Mm -hmm. And I think you can try this for free, right? You sign yep. up and yep. I think it gives you three images um, that you can try out, maybe more than that, but it has their watermark on it. Mm -hmm. So we've both paid for the service. We're both playing with it a lot. Travis is doing some more advanced stuff as you're going to see here in a minute, but let's go ahead, Trav, to the screen once you're logged in and we're going to actually create a couple images live right here and we're going to start travis is going to upload an image mm -hmm. from his computer yeah or you could actually just type something in yeah right? but we're not doing that we're, well, we're not doing that that's what you create i don't even see where that happens because i never do that so i don't even know where that's where that's located oh you would skip to the prompt over here right. without doing an image so this is optional you do not have to upload an image here you can just go right straight to skip to the prompt and type in things, right? But what we're going to do is we're going to do something a little different. I'm going to pull in this image right here. I don't know if you guys remember this or not from Joel and I <laughs> on the moon in our Lambo. Yeah. You guys know that? So that's We got there thing. already, guys. We're from the future. We've been to the moon. We've got our mm -hmm. Lambo. Now, this is where it gets really fun. You could either click one of the prefab that it has there, a portrait of a main character, a secret garden, or you can go ahead and type your own. And Travis is typing in two guys doing what? Well, in we're in a Lamborghini. Lamborghini. I think I missed, did I misspell it. No, I spelled it correctly. I just, oh, I just didn't have the capital on the moon okay. uh, with the earth in the background. Right. And then he's going to click continue okay. and you can see that it's going to cost him eight credits here in the session. So click the continue above right there. And now it's going to say, pick the style. They have some prefab styles. So when you play with it first, you can choose one of these just to get an idea of what it's going to be. But Trav has a style in mind. So I'm what do you got? Really on this one, I kind of want to keep it similar to where it was. So it was kind of a space age illustration art. 
is really what it is. However, you could use things like Art Nouveau, type that in, like pow, pow, and it would say an elegant oil painting with gold leaf patterns, intricate, enlightenment, highly detailed Art Nouveau. Or you could say steampunk style, still from a retro futuristic film, lo-fi steampunk, cinematic focus, realistic, et cetera, et cetera, by this particular artist. So you can bring in styles of this particular artist but all I'm going to say is a space age illustration, and I'm going to continue to the settings. So right here, we have options of how long do I want this video? Well, as you can see, or maybe not see, I have 888 credits. I like a little bit of a longer video, so I'm going to say 21 seconds. You know what? I'm going to say 15 seconds on this one. Every second is a credit, by the way. Yeah. So this is a 15 credit video. And now what you I have pick. found, by the way, is if I say I want a 15 second video, I better do 16 seconds. For some odd reason, it ends up normally always cutting one off. So if I want to do a 21 second video, I would always do 22 seconds, which I think I'm going to do. Okay. And then the camera movement, you can leave it static or you can tell it to do some interesting things. Pick one of the interesting things just so we can see what that looks like. I usually use static. Some people like to do the, the zoom in, the zoom out. It will rotate it, rotate it clockwise. So let me go ahead and zoom in. So we will zoom into us in the Lamborghini and say, do you want to see the initial image in the first frame? We can or we cannot. I usually leave it in, but it's not necessary. But one thing I do like is I like the boomerang effect where the video will play forward. It'll get to a certain point and then it will pull back and then get to that main point. That way it creates a nice loop. So here's where some magic really happens is right here, the evolution feature. So if you want it to be very similar to what we originally saw, then we want to have it very low. We could be like, okay, maybe I would keep it at a three. So it's going to stay mostly stable. It's going to stay very similar to where that original image was. Or I can say, let's do something really off the wall. So let's go up to a number nine. And that's going to be more wild. It's going to be more diverse. And it's going to evolve much, much more, Joel. So now so what you, I'll do is, is that what you're going to go with? I'm, yeah, right. I'm just going to do that. I'm going to hit the generation feature now. Okay, so now it's going to take, you know, this one says around 10 seconds. Sometimes it could take several minutes for it to do that. But while it's making that, you don't have to stay on that page. While it's making this, let's go ahead and look at some of the other things that you've created there, Trav. Yeah. Please. So what I typically will do, which you don't have to, but what I do is I, we, you know, we kind of build on the knowledge we've already taught you, create something cool in mid-journey, right? And then bring that into Kyber. That's typically what I do. So for this one right here, this is basically what I told it. I want the future of the, I told, I told mid journey this, I said, I want the future of the internet web three colorful, imaginative metaverse in the center of the image. I want a big blue hexagon black hole in the style of this was actually in this uh, Kyber intergalactic multiple colors. And then I added neon iridescent vibrations. It gave me that which huh. I was really pleased with that one right there. It came out pretty awesome. That's so cool. Now I want to add here, since uh, this is being recorded remotely and we're recording on Zoom, the images are a little glitchy, what you're seeing, but when you view them uh, in actuality, they're a lot smoother. Uh, mm -hmm. It doesn't look like it's hopping frames like it is here. They are. It's a very, very smooth transition. Yeah, and these right here are some things that I... What my thought process was, I've learned how to do some image masking on videos. And I said, okay, what I can do is speak inside of these videos. Well, let's create some cool backgrounds. So I did a video where I was right there in the middle of that hexagon right there, which came out pretty cool. <clears throat> Excuse me. I like the boy with the headphones on in front of this colorful internet machine. Uh -huh. The internet machine. <laughs> the magical internet machine. Let's go to your next page and see. Yeah, that's pretty cool. From there. Uh, you know, you've obviously you've made 127 videos so far. That is wow. These are so amazing, gang. You can do this. I mean, by now you're going to AI show .io and hold right there for a second. I'm talking about this. Sec. You're going to go to AI show .io forward slash Kyber K A I B E R. Why that link instead of going directly? Because Travis gets credits when you go sign up. He doesn't get paid anything. He just gets some extra credits that he can use to create more stuff. And that means we can create things that um, we can drop to you as NFTs, which by the way, stay tuned for the end of the show, because if you're listening, you're going to find out how to get an NFT of one of the images that we're making today. 
Uh, there's yeah. you and Chris Snook on the right side on the uh, floor of the New York Stock Exchange. Yeah. Now notice that one right there was one that I did that was like a one or a two on the evolving scale. So mm -hmm. I didn't want it to go too crazy because every time that I've done it too crazy, it ends up morphing it into looking not like us anything at all. In the start, we're laughing and having a good time in the style of the 1600s, <laughs> as you can tell, we're very fancy and notice our teeth get really gross. Oh, yeah, we need some dental work. I I'm not a huge fan of this one, um, so I don't think we're going to drop this one, but mm -hmm. I'm going to show hey, not you. Not everyone's a masterpiece, folks. You know what? It's like there's a little bit of testing, figuring it out. Did this one work? Did that one work? And I go, you know what? I don't like that style at all. Let me do another style and look at the style you did. So here's one, two podcast hosts in a 3D style, Octane Render, 8K, ray tracing, hyper detailed. There's you and I, I'm going to hand this image over to you and you're going to put a bad AI logo on it. And we are going to airdrop this as an NFT to those who are holding the bad crypto nifty club membership NFT. And I'm not sure exactly what day this episode was releasing, but 48 hours after this episode releases is when we're going to cut it off. You have to have this in your wallet by then. If you don't get this NFT, then it's because you didn't have the bad crypto nifty club yeah. NFT in your wallet. There's a lot of airdrops like this yeah. is the best purchase you can make. The only reason we're putting any price on it at all is so the bots don't take these for free. So 0 0.002 ETH, currently $3 for 54 cents. And yep. uh, you'll get NFTs on Polygon. I would say this, it'd probably be a good idea for you to go ahead and, you know, eat, like the video, subscribe, but hit that bell. So, you know, when a new video comes out, so you can watch it because there might be something you need to do to go claim that free NFT that we're launching. So we're merging all the worlds over here with the things and the stuffs. So... We did a couple of tests. The first one doesn't always look good. This is the first one that we had tried. So I'm going to go ahead and full screen this bad boy. There we are on the moon. Oh, there looks we like there's we're, we're outside the Lambo now. We're we're in the spacesuit. Yeah, and there's two Lambos. Around. Yeah, and we're like, give us lots of Saturns. We need <laughs> all. Give us all of the Saturn. Throw a little bit of Jupiter in there. It's not yeah, a it's, Saturn. It's a Lamborghini. Why? why? I don't know, I'm talking about. <laughs> All of the spacey Saturns. I like it that the Earth is changing too. It literally looks yeah. like it goes from uh, it ch just changed into South America. Then it became an astronaut. So it's kind of crazy. These are a trip to play around with. Let us look at the other one here real quick. So there was that one. And here's the other one right here. So you can see we are hanging out in the Lambo. And uh, this one seems a little better. I like this one seems to be kind of spacey. We're all we're flying around. We did get out of the Lambo. Then another Lambo showed up. That was nice. I always like whenever you can like two extra Lambos. And uh, there's some spacey stuff popping in. AI doesn't really quite understand space yet. It doesn't. Let's put like 40 planets all right here. And uh, it doesn't quite work like that. AI. And let's put an Earth and then let's put another Earth and then. Okay. All the Earths. I'm trying to figure out what it's all about, but uh, there's another Saturn. It loves Saturn. Apparently, AI loves Saturn. Joel. Well, there you go. You guys want to go over to um, aishow.io forward slash Kyber. Link's right there on the screen. Going to be in the show notes for this episode. Check it out. Go play with Kyber and uh, let us know what kind of creations you're able to come up with. You know, maybe uh, tweet us at at bad crypto podcast on Twitter and share your uh, your creations with us. We would love yeah. to see what you got going on. Maybe a week after we're up until a week afterwards, you tweet us out your favorite ones. We'll pick one and maybe send you another uh, NFT that you don't have. Miracles you can happen Miracles as long can, as we're going to make the AI. We're going to make the NFT with AI. So it's not really work at all. There you go. So thanks for listening. Make sure you're subscribed. Review. Remember, there is a special treat for those of you who do a five star review. Screenshot the review for us on iTunes and send us your Ethereum wallet address and you could get the golden bad AI show NFT. You want to send it to bad crypto podcast at Gmail dot com and uh, looking forward to seeing your feedback there feel free to use ai to write the review main thing is you get it up there let others know about the show catch you on the next episode until then stay bad